So I have come a long way. Indeed. Indeed, you have. Uh, you know, we're considering the... Uh, uh, you, you, you have. And uh, you, it's not as if you're in your 80s or anything like that. Uh, so relatively speaking, you can be an honorary youth and uh, you've achieved uh, so uh, very much. But now when it comes to your beloved people of uh, Abia State, what is the focus that you would uh, hope to um, um, make them have? That when you're talking about Gregory Ibe, this is what, I mean, there's a whole plethora of, uh, of stuff, of advantages that uh, any governor would bring to any state. But is there, can I say health? Care delivery seems to be a, a, a special interest of yours, among others. Forty-two for United Nations. I've written my own personal books, about eight books. I am the director of research and development for Abia Elders Forum. So Abia is something that is a, a state, 17 local government that I have studied because I have been in 774 local government. I have a house in Oshobo. I am working in a kitty state. I do a kitty as I speak to you now, World Bank project. I am everywhere you can mention about. But in Abia state, wherever in the past 24 years, the PDP have failed or have whatever effort they've put in. I want to climb on top of them and then provide the much needed development so that we can maintain our number one position in Iber State. Okay. I am not condemning anybody of whatever you've done, but I am coming with the expertise that nobody has ever had because I have foreign people, I have local people, and I'm using my personal, my personal name of owning a university in Abia State. Nobody has an address. Everybody seeking to govern the state I can only post, uh, 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 said he has one duplex in Abia State. I have a university with 62 courses. I have medical school. So I, I'm, I'm putting my, my all that God has given to me to bear to reassure the people of Abia that if it is development, they will get it in full dose. How about um, uh, political experience? Uh, because that also must be very important, um, especially uh, also, and then your associations. You, I'm sure you'll be the first to tell me that no politician succeeds alone. He must have a team around him uh, that are of like minds. Um, uh, let, let's talk a bit about that. Um, your uh, political uh, experience, uh, if you think that is uh, very important to this particular quest. Let, if I take you back, um, if I take you a little bit back, sure. I, I, I want the people that will know what I mean, if I start to say one word now is, all the security men and the wives of, may he so rest in peace, MK Abiola, they will know that I visit the house and I see him early morning by 10 a.m. in his bedroom. And he sends me on an errand, which means I didn't start today. I started very early in life. And for our Baba, President Oba Sanjo, who called me on phone to come and see him when I started the public service reform of Nigeria, you can go and ask him. He, he must be listening to this radio. He's my father. Um, uh, he met me. I became consultant on review of railway, second railway master plan. He made me consultant uh, on maritime education. I represent him in the UN on UNTAD. I am education consultant to the ministry, and I revamped the study of sciences in primary schools, secondary schools, and the universities. And as I speak to you, the name of my company is called Skill G. Every 
university in Nigeria, every polytechnic in Nigeria, every, both state and federal, everything in the engineering is my product. So when you talk about political experience, you will not take me away from me because I have served almost all the presidents. I built Federal Secretary Gariki. So I, I, I served IBB. Okay. When he was in government. Okay. I, so I, politically, I have the experience beyond most people. I work with the Kaiti, may so rest in peace, when I was doing the public service reform. And the Bureau of Public Service Reform was my own personal idea. Mm. Mm. Okay. And I, I also consulted for the Minister of Agriculture. Okay. Now, of course, there will be contentions. Uh, talk to me a bit about um, uh, your losing uh, at the uh, federal, uh, I mean, at the uh, High Court. Um, talking now about um, the federal High Court judgment uh, over the gubernatorial uh, primaries. Um, two days after we got a judgment in Omoaya, another High Court in Abuja came with another rerun. These matters are in the court, but just note that this is the high court, this is another high court. So which means the case has to move to an appellate court. So there's no, I, I, I don't want to go into any content of any matter, but let the appellate court look at these things and then take a decision. But whether I won the primaries, it was fully streamed live. And it is all there in the space for anybody to see. So I have a judgment in Omaha, another, ju another judgment of another high court in uh, Abuja. Okay. So I'm, I, I'm, I am more based here, and the politics is local. So I'm, I'm still using the decision of the high court in Omaha to go ahead in what I'm doing. Okay. But we have appealed, and we're staying the judgment as well. All right. Uh, so, so why I asked that is that since you are the candidate of um, APCA, um, you must be in good standing with the party, but it would appear that there is contention. Otherwise, it is only APCA that could go to court to challenge uh, aspects of the uh, primary. So I want to ask you about relations within the party because, um, uh, yes, you are determined to, 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 to get um, what you must see as your mandate back, uh, but talk to me about uh, relations within the party. Is there any uh, strife that, is, uh, that could uh, jeopardize this or... Uh, these... as, 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 as soon as I won the, the primaries, in the spirit of sportsmanship, I'm a weightlifter by, the, by my training. So I went to ask them to join back and let us move our party forward. But as you continue to take the drinks and you continue to talk to them, you see that they are neither APGA member or they are representing somebody to make sure that APGA did not succeed. So I went to them one after another and asked them, let us build APGA. So if anybody tells you he belongs to APGA and is creating trouble for APGA, the person is not really an APGA person. Okay. Rather, he must be playing a role for somebody else. But I wish them well. Because all that IBA want now is a total change. And that change, God will give us the change that is required. I don't have any other father, no mother, um, except Almighty God. Even as we speak now, I am on a quiet moment in order to uh, uh, finish with my father's right. My father is the king, and this week is the final right. Uh, oh, that's, uh, until oh. I finish oh. on Sunday. Okay.